Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 aka Frostbite 3 game and high resistance requirements for nothing is a DLC for Garden Warfare 1. Well, not exactly, but what's changed from the original? Yet, that's true, nothing. The only thing that has changed are the system requirements. As you can see on this PC at 1024 by 768 and everything on its lowest possible settings, we are getting around 13 to 15 frames per second. Let's try to make it at least 25 to 30 frames per second, that's the frame rate that most low specs PC gamers are aiming towards. And consider it as a playable frame rate. Don't worry, there's a solution for that. Lospex Experience is the only software ever developed 100% dedicated to Lospex PC gamers. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this bad boy will downgrade your game to even lower settings than you can go in your game options. So without any further ado, let's jump straight into it. First of all, download Lospex Experience, then install it. After it's installed, uh, don't forget to open it. Then once this screen pops up, select Optimize tab. Again, on the left side, select Optimize. Now from this drop down menu select Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2, this screen should pop up. Now everything you need to do is to simply select the resolution you want to run your game on. For example I will select 800 by 600. Now don't forget to copy this tag inside this text document, same as reboot of Need for Speed video. Just paste it to your game properties inside Origin or on your game shortcut target. It's very simple, once you did that start your game. So now we are getting around 27 to 30 frames per second, much more than I actually expected for such a low end PC, at least it's playable, yeah. And yeah, if you are not really happy with these results or the look of the graphics, you can always restore default game settings, head back to Lost Experience and select restore default. Also, if you have any problems, questions or anything to ask related to Lost Experience, make sure to do that through the help tab and we'll gladly answer all of your questions usually under 24 hours. And that is it for this video, now I'm leaving you with what's left of this gameplay and yeah, don't forget to like the video if you liked it, uh, dislike the video if you disliked it, leave a comment below, share with your friends, do whatever you want and I'll see you next time with a whole new video. Bye bye.